A lot was done in July to close the thermal loop of the Savalmash Design and Technological Bureau, which is under construction. The event of the month at the construction site, the builders finished pouring the subconcrete on the ground floor of the demonstration and utility building, and thus finished all the subconcrete in the building. After that, they began to prepare for the hydro-isolation of the floor of the ground floor, which will be followed by pouring concrete on the floor. The specialists have also completed the installation of all the window frames, ventilation grills, canopies and storm water drains, and they are close to completing the installation of the exterior cladding. Work continued in other areas as well – fireproofing of the metal constructions, installation of interim partitions on the second floor of the building, cladding of staircases and installation of fire stairs. Engineers from Sovelmash are working on upgrading the BTR-80A electric armored personal carrier. The vehicle is being prepared for participation in the Army 2022 exhibition to demonstrate the possibility of implementing the Slavanka technology on various equipment. The armored vehicle was demilitarized and delivered to the construction site. A motor with combined Slavanka windings will be installed on each of the eight wheels of the old Terran vehicle. Electric motors from IU-100 series were chosen as donors. Several much specialists are now modernizing them. The upgraded armored vehicle will have improved running characteristics. In July, an article about Sovelmash was published in the industry newsletter Russian Public Transport. This digest is published annually by the organizers of the Russian Public Transport Week, which includes the Electro Trans exhibition. The exhibition will take place in September in Moscow, and Sovelmash will take part in it. The article describes the advantages of Slavanka technology, application of the technology in transport, several Masha's innovative developments and services of the Future Engineering Center. Another article was published in the Zelenograd newspaper 41. It is devoted to the start of several Masha's production of gearless elevator motors with increased efficiency. These and other publications about several Masha are available on the company's website in the Media About Us section. The Solar Group International Conference was announced in July. It will take place on August 6 in the Congress Center of Technopolis Moscow Special Economic Zone, not far from the site where the Sovelmash Bureau is being constructed. Representatives of Solar Group, Sovelmash and their partners will speak at the conference. There will be presented documents of the companies and samples of equipment based on Slavanka technology. Conference guests will have a chance to see the Bureau under construction up close and talk to investors and project partners from different countries. In July, the most profitable promotion in the history of the project Duinov's Motors was launched. You buy a new investment package or increase the current one and receive from 10 to 50% of bonus investment shares. The more expensive the package, the more bonuses you get. You can buy a new package at the discount of the current stage if you are a new investor or at the discount of the package you bought earlier if you are an existing investor. Funds received within the framework of the promotion will be used for laying the engineering networks and starting the heating in several much desired technological bureau. Invest on the most favorable conditions and support the project. Solar Group announced a video feedback context for the Duinos Motors project. An investor from any country can take part in it. The 10 best authors will receive from $100 to $1,000 to buy investment shares. You must fulfill all the conditions of the context until August 5th inclusive. You can find the context details following the link in the video description. You still have time to take part and get the cash prize. <laughs>